What is up everybody, it is your boy Garbage Gut, and I'm putting out a disclaimer for the entire series of Martha is Dead. If you can't handle blood, gore, disturbing, unsettling images, if you have a weak stomach, do not watch this series. You have been warned. How's it going everybody? It's your boy Garbage Gut and today we are back with another episode of Martha is Dead. Now, last time we had left off on, we had to go and collect these cameras that we had set up around the lake and we ended up seeing Martha's ghost. She grabbed us and we ran away. Next thing we know, we go back into the woods, running away, and we find a bony or skulls, skeletons, and whatnot. We finally make our way back into the house, and you know the rest from there. We check the coffin, some weird stuff happened, and now, on with the let's play, shall we? Load game. So, it's been Friday, the latest episode has been posted, and this will be coming out on Monday. Oh boy, let's see what our objective is. How do we go back to the objectives? Here we go. Uh, uh, get ready for the day. Things to do, I am dirty and bloodstained, I should wash myself and get ready. Alrighty, gotta stop him and escape like that. Oh, don't need clothes for. Oh, wait a minute. There we go. Let's wash up. Uh, okay. <laughs> we had to pick a morning waz. That was disgusting. But I still don't understand all of that blood. It's never happened to me before. But I'm not going to tell my doctor. Otherwise, he'll make me stay in bed and rest. Alright. Let's get some clothes on. Some clean clothes. Oop. Didn't work. <laughs> Let's wear this one today. Kind of chilly out. Alrighty. Let's see what the rest of it is. Dress yourself, take the bag with the camera and rolls of film. Roger Dodger, 10 4. Take the bag. What's the next one? Requirements, additional info. I don't care. Bathroom is next to my bedroom. Already got that. Develop the rolls of film. Back to the basement. It's very rude, but I could pick up the phone and listen to their conversation. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's listen. There's the phone. Locked. Strange. Why did they lock my room? What? Okay. Where's the phone at? Oh, we passed it. Because we're done. How are you doing today, Rennie? I'm worried, Father. Very worried. We found more partisan tracks in the woods, right next to the house. That Lapo. I suspect he may be involved in the death of... No. Please don't say that. It, it's not possible. I know mm. that when I don't... Father, anything is possible in these dark times. Anything. That boy didn't even come to say goodbye to Julia. Didn't they love each other dearly? He must be terribly scared. Julia always used to say that. Yeah, sure, she used to say they were just friends. But you know too, right? Friends are not supposed to do such things, Father. Or are they? But anyway, you're defending them both. 
my husband, and even the nanny, who deep down is a good woman. The nanny. I believe the nanny is the one who murdered you with an evil passion for those cards. They are cursed things. I hope you made them disappear. Of course. I keep them safe in my room. Anyway, you must forgive me, Father. I have to go. They've come to pick me up. Have a good day. You too. Oh. Lapo's involved in Martha's death. My mother was losing her mind to her. How could anyone even imagine such nonsense? And Donatilio. He is a great friend, but it's a wicked view. <laughs> Those cards are just a game. Most importantly, they're mine. Why on earth would they take them from me? Ooh, notice. What do we have here? The superior commander of the German Federal Armed Forces announces, one, whoever is in possession of weapons or explosives not reported to the German headquarters will be shot. Two, whoever harbors bandits and or protects them and provides them with clothing and or weapons will be shot. Three, whoever is aware of the existence of any rebel groups or even known rebels without reporting them will be shot. Okay, everyone will be shot. Noted. Just stay inside, everybody. Stay inside and you won't get shot. Oh, God. It's the coronavirus all over again. Lock your doors. Get them down. Control the media. Control the people. Ah! Let's develop the film. Itchy. Daddy set up his dark room here. He doesn't take photos anymore because of his work, which photography is still his true passion. I'm allowed to use the dark room when I want to. Ooh, what are these? Mm. A lens and a roll of infrared film. They can photograph what the naked eye cannot see. Okay. Neat. Okay, let's do this. I'll just skip all that. Choose a photo. God, that's still creepy, creepy, creepy. Oh. Let's develop this. Expose it. Oh. Okay. Skip that process. Y'all see anything? All I see is that rag. Put it in the album, I guess. Okay, what was the next objective? Develop the roles of film. Oh. Which roles now? Wait a minute. I have to be careful and keep the volume down as I listen. I must go unnoticed. I am meant to be deaf after all. for last week's concert. <laughs> I never heard the recording. But I was right. My voice is awful. It cannot be called singing. Anyway, it's time I develop these film roles. I can't wait any longer. I wish I could just stop time. How many times do I gotta do this? Oh, oh yeah, that's right. We had three different cameras. That's right. There we go. Okay. 
Okay, that one's a little bit long. Whoa. Whoa, develop. We have to develop all of them, don't we? We'll develop this one first. Develop. Skip that, we'll come here. Oh, I wish we could skip this tedious part. I'm carrying Martha to shore. I'm trying to save her. My memories, although fuzzy, do match reality. I feel a little better. Now I can find out who really hurt Martha. Maybe I should meet with the white lady. She might be able to tell me something. Is meet this with crazy the white lady? Me? Yes, definitely. What's normal about any of this? Maybe you have to be a little crazy to get anything done. What? What's the next one? Develop the photo. Done. Uh, requirements of tarot cards, go to the lake, find the tarot cards, take photo of Martha. Huh. Okay, so you should have already been checked. Okay, so we need to go find the tarot cards. Am I even pronouncing that right? Tarot, tarot, canogit? <laughs> Okay, so first we need to find the tarot cards. The cards, the cards! I don't know where to go for the cards. Maybe it'll show up on my... Yep. So they're still inside the house. Are they in that locked room? That would suck if they were in the locked room. Because uh, I don't know where the key is. <laughs> Tripod? This can't be as fast as you can run. Oh, wait a minute. I was... Are these the tarot cards? Lorenzini Haberdashery. Five meters of gray cotton fabric. Six meters of white linen fabric. Four meters of green satin. Delivered on June 5th, 1944. In the event of an issue, contact us on the number 6987. And this red fabric? It's not being mentioned. Oh. Could this also be one of Mummy's, or could the nanny have left it here? Caesars. Why is it called Little Caesars? Because they it's use the Little Caesars to cut their pizza. <laughs> I know. Terrible joke. Terrible. Mummy's sewing machine. She learnt how to sew because nobody else could do it to her liking. <laughs> Mummy's I medicine. Will they do her any good? <clears throat> okay, that's just why. Okay. But where, oh where, are the tarot cards gone? Where, oh where, are my tarot cards have gone? I hear a plane of coming. Oh, I gotta take a picture of this? I'd really rather not. But okay. Got it. It'd be nice to have you always by my side, even if it's just a picture. Okay, tarot cards, tarot cards. 
Where, oh where, with the tarot cards. I liked watching Nanny as she cooked. I always picked up loads of techniques. Oh boy, I got a new skin for the camera. I had to guess the tarot cards are somewhere up here. Right? Following the dramatic news from the camera. Anything in here? No. Who painted? I wish I could paint. We have not tear cards. Hmm. No tear cards here. Oh, there's a note. Dear mother, this is hard, but I have something to tell you. I found out that Julia is pregnant. Go to the lake tomorrow morning at 7 and watch her as she bathes. You will see that her tummy is growing. What? I'm not pregnant. Why is everything becoming even more confusing? I'm searching for an explanation, but instead I'm left with more questions. Cool rifle. This is Mummy's jewelry. She wears them every day. Even though Daddy says it's impractical and dangerous to show signs of wealth these days. As usual, she doesn't want to listen to reason and ends up arguing with Daddy until he goes to play war, as she says. Hmm. Terracles? Yeah! They're my cards. Nanny and I always used to play with them. She would predict my future and I pretended to predict hers. <laughs> the future was always good for everyone. Maybe when she read them she saw my true future which she hid from me. Or more likely, these cards are actually just a stupid game to reassure and deceive oneself with. But deceiving oneself is sometimes necessary. How can we live happily otherwise? <laughs> Facts. Okay. What's our next objective? Go to the lake. Ba -da -ba 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 -na 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 -na. Gotta go to the lake. Oh. Okay. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Gotta go down to the lake. To the black we go oh. da -da 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 -da. Don't even comment down below Saying that I cannot sing I am already aware of that That doesn't mean I'm gonna stop As he stops singing <laughs> Okay, which way to the lake? Because I cannot remember. So, anyway, guys, how are y'all doing? Let me know down in the comments below. Let me know how you're doing. How's your mental health? How's your physical health? I'm going to use some positive mental attitude, as one YouTuber had said PMA. Or you don't have to. I don't really care. <laughs> I know, that was kind of rude. Are we even going in the right direction? We are not. Okay. Oh, maybe. Is this a way to get to the lake? Get out of here, fly. Little buzz buzz. This is totally not the way. I'm lost. <laughs> Oopsie. There's a shed. Nope, oh, can't go that way. Anyone else feel like they're being watched right now? I certainly must do. I do like the scenery, how about y'all? Let me know down in the comments below. Do you enjoy the scenery of the game? I, for one, think the scenery looks amazing. 
Okay, so we're back here. I ain't taking a whoa, wait. GL. Who's GL? Gumbly. Is that what GL stands for? Gumbly. Or does it stand for something else? Like, I don't know. Gary and Lala? I don't know. Lola, there we go. Gary and Lola. Hashtag forever. I came here to fish when I was little. I went with that ever so kind man who worked for my father. <laughs> who knows where he is now? Maybe he joined the war too. Why, Why is the X here? I have gone a very terrible route. I need to go over there to the bridge. Okay, we're gonna be right back. And we're back. Not quite at the lake yet, but we are in the direction. Nope. What the fuck? I don't know if we should go down to the lake. Okay, so we follow the soldiers then? Oh god, we're stuck. Alright, that's getting weird. Let's look at the pack. Okay. Ah, stop that. So we're back on the road. So they ran that way, so what we need to do is go down this path, and there should be another path for us to take. Ah! Why? What is with this music? Am I gonna die? Oh man. Wow, you just get your legs blown off, huh? Oh, Julia and Lapo, that's what GL was. Your handkerchief was the symbol of what you believed in. At least that is left of me. What in the world, man? Dear Julia, are you surprised that I've addressed this to you and don't think you're dead? Everyone calls you Martha now, right? I know you too well. I can never understand why no one else can ever tell you apart. Not even your own mother and father. Martha is gone and I cannot reconcile myself. Did I just get shot? Shut! What? Du hast ein Mädchen erschossen, du Idiot! Scheiße, scheiße, scheiße! Was machen wir jetzt? Sieh mal, was sie um ihren Hals hat. Sie ist eine von ihnen. Es musste getan werden. Sie ist die Tochter von General Erich K., du verdammter Trottel! 
Sie war die Freundin von diesem armen Kerl. Oh, verdammt, jetzt sind wir wirklich am Arsch. Scheiße, lass uns abhauen. Aber, aber sie lebt noch. Sie liegt im Sterben. Siehst du, wo du sie getroffen hast? Sie ist bestimmt schon tot. Wir müssen jetzt abhauen, sonst sind wir auch bald tot. Why did we get shot? So I looked in the camera <laughs> and I had the most ugly freaking free, uh, freeze frame. It was just, why did we get sh I'm dying, I think. But strangely <laughs> enough, I wasn't afraid. In fact, I was almost relieved. When I returned, I found myself once again in the midst of a bad dream. One whose meaning I did not understand at the time. Oh, uh, Martha? I give you back? Your... Appearance. What is going on? I give you back. Is it raining blood? I give you back. Oh my god, that's so freaky. I give you oh. It's raining blood. Oh god. That's still gross. Oh, why you guys show me a close up of the eye? I give you back. That's so disturbing. I give you back. Okay, I get it, Martha. I give you back your appearance. We get it. God, back your appearance. That's spooky, though. Ugh. Oh, uh, you now? No. Okay. So now I pay. Nope. Now I see through your with my eyes dreams. Cause you described it as a dream. I really don't like this part of the game. I feel like the more you get wrong, then the more we're gonna die. This is spooky. I'm sorry, what? What? Oh, why are you taking the body? Why are you taking the body? It's so creepy. I mean, the music is well done. Don't get me wrong, but that is creepy. Oh. Two sisters were destined to die. Julia, the first sister, and Martha, the second. On Julia's day of departing, identical twins stood before me, impossible to tell apart. They questioned my presence, since they were still so young. Julia must come with me, I demanded. But they both claimed to be Martha. I explained that Martha's fate was soon to be the same, and their games were useless. I didn't have time for it. The war was keeping me busy. But they didn't concede, and instead kept insisting. Can we follow you together? No, impossible. Are you sure Martha will die too? Nothing is certain in wartime. What if the wrong person went with you? 
Then you would have cheated death. One would die unjustly, and the other would simply be delaying her fate. They discussed amongst themselves, then hugged before one of them came forward. She stared in a determined, almost threatening manner. I guessed it was Martha sacrificing herself, giving more time to her sister. But I stayed silent, not to reveal their failed deception. No one lies to the face of their own death. So I asked how their choice was reached. We do lots by throwing a medallion, she said quietly. They had trusted in fate. Oh, how naive they were. Okay. They knew fate plays by its own rules, which is true, but it is also my ally. Fate never would have allowed the wrong girl to follow me. In that case, my work was done. She must have been Julia. However, little to my knowledge at the time, that blasted medallion had the same name engraved on both sides. Martha's. So, my first assumption was correct. They were too damned smart and had fooled both fate and me. One thing is for sure. I'll put things back where they belong. I will correct my ignorance and give fate back its blindfold. Okay, so Julia was supposed to die first and then Martha? Doesn't make any goddamn sense. This don't make no goddamn sense. I think it's a turn. Uh, interesting turn. Damn, this hurts so bad. I can hardly breathe. Why are you upside down? The burial. Four days after Martha's death. Mine 15. Okay, so guys, I am all out of time, unfortunately, today, but don't worry, there will be another one, and this one will be uploaded on Monday, 2 p.m. Then again, by the time y'all see this, it'll already be 2 p.m., it'll be Monday, y'all know how this works. <laughs> anyway, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this episode. This one was not as disturbing, but a little bit spooky, in a sense, I suppose. Also, am I the only one that thinks the death guy, Mr. Death, kind of sounds a little bit like Madara Uchiha? Am I the only one that thinks that? Or am I just dumb? I don't know. I'll leave that up to you guys to decide. But anyway, guys, be sure that you smash that like button. Please continue to support, and if you're not already supported, please consider supporting. I want us to be a family. I want us to be one big old community. And I hope you'll trust me in giving me that little subscribe. Because I know that you know that I know that you know you want to subscribe. We both know it. So why don't we go ahead and give it over, get it over with and click that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that notification bell icon so you never miss another one of my videos ever again. But until next time guys, this has been Garbage Up, signing off. Later.